Kari, when I used to think of what I wanted in a wife, a few things would come to mind. Shorter than me, Mexican to eat good food, and someone I could bring around my family. I'm lucky to be sitting here today about to marry a woman who is all of those things and so much more. You are beautiful, ambitious, supportive, and the nicest person I know. I hope you never change your kind spirit. Dear Paul, it's hard to believe how much we've grown over the past eight years. Think back to our first date. I remember feeling nervous yet at peace. There was something about you that made me feel comfortable. What I admire the most about you is that you never give up on what matters the most to you. I admire your motivation and strong-headed personality. It's a perfect balance for us. As your husband, I promise to be your biggest supporter in all of your dreams and aspirations. I promise to love you always and do my best to listen to your needs. I will do my best to learn how to be patient. Your wife promises to love you unconditionally. Promise to support you and take care of you. I'll always love you and need you in my life. See you soon, my love. I, Paul, take you, Karina, to be my wife. In good times and in bad, I promise to be faithful to you sickness and in health, to love you and honor you all the days of my life. I, Karina, take you, Paul, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and honor you all the days of my life. Mr. and Mrs. Paul and Karina now. Looking further out, I'm excited to spend the next year or so making special memories with you before we start a family. I can't wait to see you as a great mom that I know you will be. I'm excited to start this new journey in life with you. I love you, bub. <laughs> I've dreamed about this day ever since I was a little girl. But what brings me the most happiness is knowing that our love is so strong and will carry this into our long-lasting marriage. It was 10 years ago that my wife, Elibe, and I let her go to college. She left us from Salinas, and I remember when we left her, it was like a six-hour drive. We had a lot of thought, thought, wow, here's our 17-year-old daughter, we let her go to college. But who would have thought that that's where she would have found her love of her life? Today, before God, they made a commitment to love and honor each other for life.
wanted to start off by thanking uh, everybody that's here. Uh, each of you have played a big role in mine and Karina's relationship, and we recognize that it's it's not just me and Karina, that it's me, Karina, our families, our friends, and we appreciate you. So thank you very much.